Yeah, what's going on everybody? Sidepod King Carter here, the super mini YouTube. Today you know I had to bring you a great video. This footage right here is from me against the Bulls. Um, yes, I don't have this gameplay. The reason I don't have this gameplay is because Joe, Joe Kim Noah was not in the game. So, me getting to the room, it was just too easy. I didn't have any, you know, opposition. I was just doing what I wanted to do against the Bulls. And you will see how many points I have at the end of this my player of the game reel. Now, the game that I do want to talk about is me versus CP3 and Blake Griffin. God damn, it's gonna be it's gonna be major. But let's get into this post game conference real quick, y'all. I'll be back. That might have been your best game as a pro. You had your best scoring output ever, so clearly something was clicking. Did this just happen to be a good game, or is this the type of level we're going to see you playing at from here on out? None of the above, man. We just scratching the surface with me. By this time next season, you'll see me play a game like this and think something was wrong. If this is my ceiling right now, I fully expect it to be my floor before too long. It's only a matter of time. Oof, this was long awaited. Now, first off, check on my dribble moves real quick. I got CP3 on me, so I wanted to feel like I had a little bit of dribble. You know, I drained it in his face. He only about, what, 6'2", 6'3", at the most. It ain't about nothing. But here, this is something you guys want to see. Blake Griffin to the mother goddamn rat. This dude, look at this. Hold on, one more time, one more time, one more time, one more time. Look at this. Rashard, what are you doing? You letting him house you down there. Oh, goodness gracious, we need, to, we need to trade him. This dude is in the game for no apparent reason. All right, check me out. Check out my amazing defense right here. It's, you know, a little bit of time on the clock. They gave it to the wrong man. They should have gave it to Karan for three. But you know I'm on the break. Now, remember that little thing from 2K11? You used to dribble the ball and it just get taken, taken every time. I used to be pissed at that. But, you know, I'm going to try to, you know, get out real fast. Now, check out this double team I got. You notice I didn't pass it to Richard. I don't like him at all. You know who I'd rather give it to, man? Myself. So, guess what I'm going to do? Nice little backup jump shot. The easiest move in 2K12 to score points. That's what I'm saying. Uh-oh. Now, right here, I just notice how I'm just putting on nice little moves. I can get past him at any time, but I wanted to pull up for a nice little jump shot. I was feeling my jump shot this game. You know, I had to take control early in the game. I was kind of mad that I had to take control because we were losing so badly. But I had to do what I had to do. So, you know, I had to let him go. Now, one thing about this match was, as I was coming back, it seemed like the more I came back, the more they wanted to play hard. And I was kind of mad, but, you know, I was putting on a nice little defense. And I'm trying to get on the break, as you can see right here. Now, I wanted to give it to Rashard, but I couldn't do it. So, I <laughs> I decided to pass it back to J-Wall, man. I just can't give it to Rashard. He's, like, the worst at this, man. But let's hurry up and get out on the break. Now, notice I call for the ball. J-Wall says, no, F that. Because I'm going to dunk on CP3. Check out. Yo, CP3, what is you doing? Did he just touch him? He wanted to get a feel. These freak boys in 2K nowadays, man. I don't know. <laughs> but, yo, check out the way Karan Butler is just putting his shuffle game on right now. But, you know, I got the leaner, you know, Kobe Bryant leaner. But it seemed like Karan Butler just had the best shuffling game on here. Yo, look at the way he's shuffling. Dude got mad shuffle game. But check out JaVel McGee. Nice little slam dunk. It ain't, I ain't going to yell too much. You should expect it from him. This dude can get up and down. Yo, did y'all see the off the backboard dunk he did? Okay, even though they were losing, he still. This is real life. I'm talking about you guys. My man threw it off the backboard to himself on a fast break. I'm just saying, you know, that's athleticism right there. I'm just saying. Low CP, you testing me? Where you going? What is that? 
Did you see what he just did? <laughs> that dude... <laughs> yo, I'm telling you, man, my jab step is vicious, y'all. I'm just saying. Uh oh, here comes the... this is hard D right here. This is hard defense. Yeah, ref. Yeah, ref. A second, but hey, sit your five dollar ass down before I make change. That coach thing. Oh my bad, yo, my bad. <laughs> this is all bigger than Nino Brown. Oh, nice pump fake. Let's go to the rim. Easy. Oh, yo. Sometimes I be pissed off because I don't get the foul call, man. I really do. It really does piss me off. But check me out. I'm on a break. You already know I love to break. Just guess what I do. You know, easy slam. I don't get no replay. And it's just because you guys going to know I didn't replay it myself. I know I'm kind of mad at that. But check me out trying to set up nice pick and roll situations. You know, for some reason, I can't get Terry off to do anything I ask. So just cut to the basket, my man. Just cut. Delay. Yo, that was the delay reaction to me hitting the icon pass button. All right, now, halftime. Check it out, man. 49% from the field goal, you know. Look at these dudes. Two for 13 from their fucking three-point line. That's what's wrong with 2K. Too many three-point shots. What happened to the nitty-gritty going inside? Nice post-up game. Didn't they say to us in the beginning when they first was going to come out with this game that they redid the post game, that they were going to give us all types of nice post moves, but nobody does them. Nobody posts up. Nobody hits fadeaway jump shots. Nobody gets down in the paint for any type of, you know, nothing. Like, I, I haven't seen anybody. Oh, damn, 26 points. Oof. But I haven't seen anybody actually get the chair pull from under them on offense in 2K12 at all. Nobody does anything in the post. But check out my man Nick Young with the steal. You know, I'm going to just let Jay Wall give it to McGee. Because it's, it's, it's only right. It's only right, you know. Check him out. Nice little, you know. He runs the floor a lot. Like, he runs the floor a lot. Oh, also, uh, shout out to my Sixers. <clears throat> we 10-3. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. We 10-3. All right. Now, uh, okay. McGee again. The, what do you want me to say? Look at it. Look at me thread the needle. I'm, I'm trying. What do you want me to do? I'm threading the needle, you guys. There's nothing that I can do. Like, JaVale McGee, as long as I got him on my team, as long as he... Oh, Lob City. See, I didn't see that one coming. See, you see how I got there late? Look how late I got there. You know what I'm saying? It was already over. John Wall already got posterized. So, you know, it was too late. I couldn't make it. It's all right. I'll get the next one. All right, here we go again. Another Lob. I tried. I tried. Now, right there, I got dunked on, but at least I tried. <laughs> look at my look at my mouth player, yo. <laughs> You're like, oh, damn, damn. Oh. Whew, I almost pulled something. <laughs> but what can you say, man? But you know what? While they tried the Live City, my man Jay Wall got something coming for them. Here goes a Live City back. What? JaVel, what? Yeah, I got something for that. I got something for that. Yeah, Jay Wall, tell him, man. You ain't going to be throwing alley-oops all game on my man. Shoot. What you talking about? But as you can see here, we losing. You know, it is what it is. We were up at one point in time, but I don't know what happened. I think it's because I tried to give the third quarter to my team and try to let them score. So I was kind of, you know, sagging off on offense the entire lot. It, it was my fault. I'm the reason that, you know, we lost this game, but... Hey, it is what it is, man. Now, check out Blake Griffin with the charge. I don't know why he was trying to spin move from that far away. It is what it is. But here comes my upcoming schedule. You know what my next video will be. <laughs> but, yeah, man, um, 34 points, 5 rebounds, 4 turnovers, 7 assists. Now, the reason I'm out is because I got 6 fouls. Yes, I was pissed. I was, I was pissed. What, I can't be mad? Oh, this is my game. I can lose if I want to. F that. But, you know, my man, he pretty mad right now. He wa he wants to punch L Rashard Lewis in the face right now. But it is what it is. But uh, thanks for watching this video, you know what I'm saying? I didn't get any objectives. Only one. Probably the teammate grade. But let's get into this post-game conference, y'all. It can't be easy to lose a game when you have the kind of performance you did tonight. What did you have to say to the team in the locker room afterwards? I just talked about where we went wrong and what we need to work on for the next game. Defensive intensity is definitely one thing. Controlling the boards a little better is another one. My own performance is really irrelevant. 
It's about the team coming together and playing well enough to get the win. Tonight, we didn't play at a high enough level, and you saw the result. Yo, why am I always trying to be a team player, man? One of these days, I'm just going to say, fuck that. It's all about me, bitches. Oh, this is IKC signing out. My bad I snapped. <laughs>